Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Allgaier again, and I was wondering if you'd like to play a game. Great. Well, we've played this game in the classroom before, but this is also a game that you could play with your mom or dad or your brothers or sisters. So sure, why not? And it's a memory game. Do you remember us playing this before? Well, I'll ask you at the end and you can tell me if you remember. The first thing you're gonna need are a couple of items. But we'll start off easy just having two items. So I've already picked some things and I actually, I picked this. Does anybody know what that is? It's easy, it's just a, that's right, a water bottle. And then I picked this. Does anybody know what that is? Well, it's, this one's hard. This one, this is a bottle of sprinkles. Did you ever have sprinkles like on a cake or something? So this is a bottle of pink sprinkles. So we'll start off easy. So you see that I have a water bottle and sprinkles. Now all you'll need is a dish towel. Remember how we've played this before? You take a dish towel and it's almost like a magic trick. I have covered those items and secretly I am going to remove one of them. You can't see. And I'm gonna put it over here. And then I'm going to say, what's missing? Do you know? That's right, it was the water bottle, remember? We had a water bottle and sprinkles and I covered it and I took the water bottle away and that was what was missing. So it's pretty easy when there's two things, but what happens when there's more than two things? Let's make it harder and harder. Well, I found this, I don't know if you can see it. Oh, it, is, it actually works. It's a flashlight. So now we have a water bottle, sprinkles, and a flashlight. Do you see that? Now, look at this. I'm gonna cover it up just like a magic trick. And I'm going to make one of them disappear. And I want you to tell me what's missing. What's missing? Did you get it? That's right, it was the sprinkles. Oh, you did it. What if I mix them up so they're not in the same order and really trick you? See, I have the flashlight, the water bottle, and the sprinkles. I'm gonna do it again. All I need is a dish towel in my kitchen, covering them up. Oh, you didn't look, did you? Good. What's missing? <gasps> Two things are missing. What is missing? Did you say the water bottle? Did you say the flashlight? If you did, you got it. Great job. All right, here we go. I'm going to add something else to it. What is it? Kool-Aid. You know, like we have in the classroom, this one is purple, it's grape. So now we have, can you see it? A water bottle, flashlight, sprinkles, and Kool-Aid. How many things are there? One, two, three, four. There are four things making them disappear, taking something away, being very secretive like a magician. And what's missing? Hmm. Well, it's not the water bottle. It's not the sprinkles or the Kool-Aid. What was right here? Do you remember? Did you say flashlight? If you did, you got it. There you go. Awesome. Now, what if I mix them up? 
Oh my goodness, I don't know if you're going to get this. And I'm going to cover it with my dish towel again. It's like secret, removing something. What's missing? Do you remember? What was right there? Hmm. Did you say Kool-Aid? If you did, you got it. If not, that's okay, because that's a lot of things to remember. Four things are a lot of things to remember. Well, now I'm going to add something more, and there will be five things. Oh, does anybody know what this is? What's that? That's butter. Do you have butter at your house? I like butter. You can probably tell. Yes, butter. So now we have Kool-Aid, butter, a water bottle, sprinkles, and the flashlight. Five things. One, two, three, four, five. Five things, remember, because guess what? What's missing? I don't know. What is it? It was the one that was right in the front. It was the new one I just put there. Do you remember? Was it the butter? Yes, indeed. It was. Now I'm going to make it even harder. I'm adding one last thing. What is that? Well, it's a battery. It's a battery. That's going to be hard to remember. So we have Kool-Aid, a water bottle, sprinkles, and a flashlight. And now we have a battery and butter. How many things is that? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six things. Ready? I have secretly removed something. Oh, something fell down. Don't look. What's missing? It was the thing that was right here. Hmm. Well, we've got the Kool-Aid and the water bottle. We've got the flashlight and the battery and the butter, but something was right there. What was that? Oh, I heard somebody say it. That's right. It was the sprinkles. Now, what happens if I mix it all up? Because we've already remembered them sort of in order. Oh, Mrs. Olgar, it's like a hurricane. Everything's mixed up. Oh, my goodness, my gracious. Everything is all in different spots. Look at that. Now we need to think again. So we have the water bottle, the Kool-Aid, the flashlight, the sprinkles, and down in front we've got butter and the battery. Okay, ready? This is gonna be tough because I'm gonna take something away and I've mixed them up. Mm, don't look. What is missing? Hmm. It was something that was right here. What was that? Oh, I heard somebody say it. That's right. It was the flashlight. You got it. All right, now we're gonna play one more way where I'm gonna take two things out. Oh mm, my goodness, this is going to be a stumper. All right, covering up all the stuff. I'm going to take this and this. Don't look. I'm putting it right here. 
Oh, two things are missing because we only have four things left. Six take away four would be two. Look at that. Hmm, what two things are missing? What? Well, that's right, the Kool-Aid. And you might remember that because you love Kool-Aid. I know you guys. And what else is missing? Hmm. It was that little thing that was in the front. Do you remember? I think I heard someone say the battery. See, and this is a game you can play with your mom or dad or your brother or sister. All you need are a couple items and a dish towel. And it sort of can be like a magician and a memory game. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? If you're playing with your younger sisters or brothers, you probably only want to use a couple items because that'd be too hard, all this. But if you're playing with older brothers and sisters, you could even add more than this and take two or three things away. Make it really tough for them. This is a game you can play all the time. And I don't know if you remember or not, but we used to play this in the classroom. Do you remember? Well, stay tuned for later tonight because I have the Gold Star Award ready to give, but I have to walk into the other room. So I'm gonna end this here and I'm gonna go finish up and tell you what the gold star, what it, who's it's going to this week. I apologize for leaving it in the living room. <clears throat> See you in a minute.